Well, Colorado Springs is home to one of the largest Thanksgiving dinner services in Southern Colorado and requires a tag team with two types of armies. Soldiers at Fort Carson working with the local Salvation Army. Bill Folsom is here with a look at the dinner they pulled off today. Bill? Yeah, well then you've got to add in all the locals who are joining the Army of Volunteers helping. They all stepped uh, up to offer meals to around 4,000 people. Dinners in Fountain, Manitou Springs, Woodland Park, and the busiest location here in Colorado Springs. A meal that is much more than just food. I'm just grateful that people have a place to go and they can get a wonderful meal. The guest list includes thousands, a few who feel like they're part of the Salvation Army circle of friends, others just wanting some company, and some thankful they have the option of a meal on Thanksgiving. This meal, thanks to days of work and the cooking skills of Fort Carson soldiers. Their commanding general stops in for a quality check. It's an honor to be here today. The Salvation Army is a great organization that Fort Carson and the 4th Infantry Division enjoys partnering with. We're an army, but we, we thrive on volunteers. Hundreds of volunteers, many who feel they get more from being here than they give. I lost a son four and a half years ago, and for me personally, I can't face that empty space at the table. So I can be here serving others and it, and it makes a difference for me, for my day, but also I can make a difference in the lives of others. It's not always clear who is giving and who is receiving. The obvious is a lot of thanksgiving. Whatever the case may be, we're just here to serve the people. And around 1,400 of those 4,000 meals went to people who are unable to leave their homes. That Salvation Army and its volunteers they delivered.